some 40 in my right car Bitches change and I like I ain't what up, BTV Squad? Berto here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Berto, and you just stumbled across my YouTube channel. Guys, I haven't done an unboxing video actually since last year, but I haven't unboxed a new iPhone on my channel since I think the iPhone XS Max, which was in 2019, I believe. I have a couple unboxing videos on my channel. It'll be on the iCard. They are cringy, so I am warning you. Um, but I'm excited to actually unbox a new phone, right? Because I haven't unboxed a phone on here in a minute, but I did end up getting the iPhone 15 Pro Max. I got it in the natural titanium in the 256 gigabyte, which is the basic um, um, memory for the 15 Pro Max this year. I do have the 13 Pro Max, which it is gonna be a trade-in. I'm trading this in. I did get the phone directly from Apple, um, so yeah, this, this is going back to Apple for my trade-in credit. Okay. Okay. And here's the phone. Guys, I'm nervous because what if I don't like this color? <laughs> like, I'm kind of scared. I usually always go with dark phones. I got a light phone for like the first time in four or five years. So, hopefully we like it. Oh, but it's bright. It's really, I'm using like my window lighting, so it's like super bright, but it's like a really blush. It's like a super light gray with some gold hue to it. Definitely lighter. Yeah. And obviously you got your basic shit in here, um, Apple saving the environment. If you want to believe that, believe that. $1,200 for a phone with no charging adapter, a braided USB-C cable, which is new because Apple has never done a braided cable for their phones, in the box at least, right? Um, and again, they are USB-C, which I don't really care about. I, it wouldn't have made or break, broke it for me if they left it lightning because everything I use, is, nothing I use is USB-C except for my computer. So I could perfectly travel with my computer charger and an iPhone charger and I'd be happy because my camera charges off the wall. Like put in the battery, you plop it out. So um, it does feel nice. Feels like it's decent quality. Hopefully it lasts. Like this, you guys can actually see the color a little bit better. Um, that's how it looks like. It is like a super light gold, I'd say. It's like a gray gold, in my opinion. When I bought the phone directly off Apple, it did give me this. Ready for, new, for your new iPhone. My data is backed up on my iPhone or whatever. They gave me an extended iCloud storage so I could save everything and transfer it through iCloud. Like, it's temporary storage that you can use to back up your phone, and then I believe now when I transfer everything is gonna go away, obviously. <laughs> but, yeah, let's do that. Let's take this off, right? Our, our protective film that, we're gonna smudge it up, but whatever. Yo. The way it feels in your hand, bro. Damn. Oh, okay. So let's see. I save everything because I end up selling my phone. <laughs> or trading it in. So we'll be back in two years. <laughs> okay. And we're at the welcome screen, bro. Ooh, okay. Damn, this screen is now... It Bro, because I come from the 13, right, which honestly is not a bad phone at all. Like, I don't really have complaints about this phone at all. But the just the bezels alone set it up. So, English, United States, appearance. This is new. Choose the size of text and icons on iPhone. Default, medium, large, default. Quick start. So, we're looking for new devices. Bring your current phone near. Let me turn on my Bluetooth on this phone because that's probably what it's reading off. So hold your camera. Okay. Getting things ready. 
set up for me. It says set up for you or a child, so for me. Enter the passcode of your other iPhone. Your account is protected by the passcode of your other iPhone. Your passcode is encrypted and cannot be read, okay? Setting up your iPhone. It may take a few minutes to activate your phone. Finish on new iPhone. Keep this iPhone near you with a new iPhone. Confirm your phone number. This is the eSIM. Your, this phone number should match the one provi provided by T-Mobile when you purchase this iPhone. If this is not the phone number you were provided, contact T-Mobile. To use a different phone number, contact T-Mobile after completing activation. So this is my phone number, so we're going to continue. Verify your identity. Enter the account PIN or the last four digits of the primary account holder. Give me a second. This is where I'm going to end the video. I'm going to have fun with my phone now. Um, finish setting it up, transferring everything. And um, next video, I'll give you guys an update, whatever my next video might be. Um, maybe it's something with my friend. It probably will be. But while that finishes, we're going to let it do its thing. Let it finish because me and my ADHD don't do well. So. Have a good rest of your day. Hopefully you guys get an idea of this color if you guys are interested in this color. Oh, that's cool. The little action button, guys. Hold up. Let me show you guys before I go. Wrong button. See? And then again. Okay. Let's go. Peace out. Take care. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha.